Hi, and this is Trey Passer, and this is my Blu-ray update for the week beginning September 2nd, 2012. There are a few titles, so I'm just going to go through them real quick, so this video doesn't last forever. Okay. The first movie I got, I went to Best Buy in Manhattan, and I saw this movie for on sale for $7.99. I haven't seen this movie since the 80s. Uh, I remember they used to show this movie on HBO all the time. Of course, it stars Matthew Broderick, uh, Dabney Coleman, and Ali Sheedy. It's War Games. Remember that? Let's play, let's play a game. <laughs> you know that that a real suspense movie right there. And I believe it was directed by Yep, John Badham. Yep. Okay. Basically about a computer that starts playing. Uh, okay, the, the sophisticated computer just that believes. Uh, I think it's okay. Advanced. Okay. That he, yeah, that's right. Matthew Broderick's character is a hacker. Okay, and he breaks the. Okay, but when he unmittingly uh, taps into the defense department computer, he initiates confrontation of global forces. Yep, and basically this computer starts playing, starts playing war games with this computer, which actually leads to this computer thinking that this is a game, and he actually starts to launch the nukes, and they basically have to stop it. Okay, so that's, that's a good movie from the 80s. Now this is another a good movie. I'm a big Johnny Depp fan, and I remember seeing this movie on HBO a long time ago. And this is like a romantic comedy. Uh, Benny and June, starring um, Johnny Depp and uh, Mary Stuart Matheson, uh, I believe, uh, what's his name? Uh, yeah, Aiden Quinn is in this also about this, uh, I guess, uh, uh, Mary Stuart Matheson's character. She's like developmentally slow, I guess you would say, and and she lives with her brother, Aiden Quinn, and then they one day they meet this character played by Johnny Depp, uh, and he's just hysterical, and he makes her laugh, you know. He, and he does, he's, he's like a Charlie Chaplin fanatic, and he does all these, let me show you the back there, and he does all these Charlie Chaplin things, and him and, and him and Mary Stuart Masson's character, you know, they start to fall in love, of course. Of course, and Aiden Quinn, you know, he's protective of his sister, so he basically kicks him out when he finds out that they've been together. And it's a really, like I said, it's a comedy, romance, a little bit of a drama there. But it's really a good movie, and I'm finally glad it's on Blu-ray. This is a really good movie. This was one of my favorites. Okay. Okay, now this next movie is a Western. I'm a big Western fan. Of course, this is The Magnificent Seven, starring Yul Brenner, uh, Steve McQueen, Charles Bronson is in this, uh, Robert Vaughn, uh, James Colburn, about these, uh, this town. They hire these uh, they hire these guys, seven guys, to protect them against... Uh, I believe, hold on, let me read it again, because I know they, against, they hire you seven gunfighters to protect their town against, yeah, uh, let's see, the only problem, uh, seven against 50, yep, yeah, you know, against these seven guys, against this, this uh, Mexican gang, I think, that, that's what they hire them for, to protect their town, okay, because they're always getting, you know, taken advantage of by this, this cruel Mexican leader, and they hire these seven <laughs> guys to um, come in and protect them. It's a really good classic western. I've seen this a ton, bunch of times. It's really good. So that was on sale for seven ninety nine. So I got that. Okay, and this another one of my favorites. Actually, I was going to order this movie from eBay a while ago, and I actually saw it in Best Buy, and I snatched it up real quick on sale for nine ninety nine. Road to Perdition. There it is. We're starring uh, Tom Hanks, Paul Newman, uh, Jude Law, and a young Daniel Craig is in this. And this is basically a story about a hitman played by Tom Hanks who works for this gangster Paul Newman and his crazy son Danny Craig and he uh, winds up by uh, uh, going against Paul Newman's Paul Newman Paul Newman's family except because his son is crazy you know, his son is nuts okay and he winds up getting his his wife and other son gets killed okay and then they come after and then Paul Newman no no then Tom Hanks kills Daniel Craig, who's Paul Newman's son, of course, so he has to go on the run with his one son, who's, who's one young son that's still alive. They go on the run, okay, and they're being chased down by Jude Law. It's just a really, really good movie, and Tom Hanks is really, really good in this, okay? And it's been a while since I've seen this, but I absolutely lo remember loving this movie, okay? Tom Hanks really surprised me. He, he's really good as his hitman, okay? Now, this next one is a movie, uh, this is a... <laughs> Animated movie, okay, The Beatles, Yellow Submarine on Blu-ray. Um, I have to give credit to Bob the Sub because um, I saw him with this, you know, I saw him with this, uh, he did it, he did his update, he showed this, and I remember seeing this movie growing up, 
tons of time on TV and stuff. So I'm anxious to see what it looks like on Blu-ray the sound. Of course, you know all the great songs from this. Uh, just a fantastic, fantastic animated movie with the songs are just outstanding. And so, so on Blu-ray, I have to see what it is. You know, it's a great, it has a bunch of special features on it. Okay, so I'm just dying to see what this, to see what it sounds like and see what it looks like on Blu-ray. The Beatles, Yellow Submarine, great music, night, beautiful animation. Okay, now this next three movie is a set of a trilogy. Um, now the reason I got the, I was, I get the Born. This is first the, uh, excuse me, let me do it in the right order. Okay, there we go. Okay, the Born Identity. Born Ultimatum and the Born Supremacy. The reason um, I got these Universal 100 Anniversary with the great slip covers of these, I was going to actually get the set of the Born movies, but then I kept trying to get them and kept one trying to win them in auction on eBay, but I couldn't win them. But I saw these there in Best Buy with these great, I love the uh, Universal 100 Anniversary slip covers. I love them so. And I, you know, like I said, I love the way it opens up like that. I love this. Just love the slip cover. Just love the slip cover. So I got them. So now I have all the born movies on Blu ray, which I really, really want to get. So I'm happy with that. Now, the next thing is a movie that I already have on Blu ray, but I start with this slip cover. And this is on sale for like $7.99 in Best Buy, Goodwill Hunting, which I saw a long time ago. This is a movie about uh, that um, Matt Damon and um, Ben Affleck wrote, and they actually, I think they won the Academy Award for Best Screenplay, yeah, Best Screenplay, yep. And Robin Williams won for Best Supporting Actor, I believe, for this movie. And, uh, yeah, okay, yeah, but, yeah, okay. But anyway, I just love the slipcover for this. This is the 15th anniversary issue, and plus it's supposed to have um, over one hour of new special features, including retrospective interviews with Matt Damon, Robin Williams, and Ben Affleck. And it got nominated for a nine Academy Award nomination, including wins for Best Supporting Actor, which is Robin Williams, and Best Original Screenplay, which for, was for Matt Damon and um, Ben Affleck. Okay, and Ben Affleck has went on to become a great uh, writer director. So, um, uh, like I said, I like the slip cover too on this. So, let's pick that up. And like I said, it's on sale for $7.99. And the last thing I got is a TV show. Now, a little bit of explanation of this. This is Once. Upon a Time, okay? Okay, this is a show that came on ABC Sunday nights, okay? And this is the complete first season, okay? I remember seeing the first episode of this and liking it, but then I got, I forgot it was on. I totally lost track of it, it was on, okay? And then I actually, um, I think I was um, watching another another Blu-ray movie and they started talking about get Once Upon, you know, Once Upon a Time, so the first season is on Blu-ray, get it, you know, and there you go. See that, this has a fantastic slip covers. If you look at that, see how it turns, it's a lenticular cover, look at it. See how that turns, once upon a time, and this is really the once, it's nice and embossed. There we go, and uh, it's 22 episodes, has a Blu-ray exclusive, delve into the history of fairy tales with Josh Dallas, Sundays this fall. I think the second season starts September 30th, I believe, and it's like five Blu-ray discs in this. And I watched 22 episodes. I've watched 13 so far. I'm probably gonna watch the rest of this night, the rest of today. It's around 7:52. I'm probably gonna try to watch three more episodes of this. This is a really good show, basically about fairy tales, and uh, that's why it's called Once Upon a Time. Now this evil queen, she plants a curse. <laughs> That transports all these uh, fairy tale characters to the modern world. Of course, they forget who they are. They don't remember who they are. And basically, this is the story of them basically uh, remembering. And the only thing that holds us together is this young boy who's who has this book with you know that has all the fairy tales in it, and he's trying to convince everybody that everything you know that it's all real. Okay, and it's really kind of complicated because it has Snow White in it, the Evil Queen. Rumple Stillskins in it. It has just all these fairy tales, you know, all these different fairy tales mixed in there. And it's really, really good, actually. A bunch of stuff about true love in it. Okay, and I just want to show you uh, the inside. Let me uh, take this out. 
And I can show you a little bit of the inside artwork right there. That tells you what's on it. Actually, let me take them. Let's see. And there's a, uh, you can see that right there, that's uh, Snow White right there. And it has pictures right, I don't know if you can see it. I would have to take this out. Hold on. If I can do this, let you see the, yeah, okay. I can do it, yeah. Let me do this. Okay, there we go. I took the disc out. It's, like I said, it has five discs in it. And it has a ton of bonus features in this. Okay, and let me show you this. And, and they, there's a beautiful inside artwork right there. Like I said, there's pictures of all the different fairy tale characters and stuff and what they look like in the modern world. Okay, you have Jiminy Cricket too in this. It's a really, really good story. You know? A lot about true love and fairy tales and everything. It's really, really good. <laughs> good show. Like I said, I'm, I've watched 13 episodes of the 22 so far, so I'm probably gonna watch three more episodes today and probably watch the rest tomorrow. Just, you know, so I can get nice and ready for the, uh, for the um, premiere of this, which starts, um, I believe on the, uh, yeah, September 30th. That's when it starts. The second season. Okay. Uh, uh, uh. And again, so that's it for my um, pickups. Let me know what you think. Feel free to leave comments down below. And this is Trey Pastor saying so long and take care.